Hey, what's going on YouTube? Soldier Knows Best here. The iPad 2 is on its way, should be here very shortly, and all the rumors and speculations are really just hitting the roof here. But with Apple releasing the iOS 4.3 software beta to all of its developers out there over the past week or so, a lot of people start to dig around that beta and find out little hints and clues about what's going to be in the next iPad. Now, the first of that is the display. A lot of people are, are hinting that it's going to be a retina type of display on the iPad 2, just like you found in the iPhone 4. And a lot of people are kind of kind of torn between the two. Now, there have been signs of people thinking that it's going to be a 2048 by 1536 display on the iPad 2, which will be amazing. Um, but a lot, a lot of people dug into the software beta and found like a, uh, a picture file of a, a piece of wood that you normally find in the iBooks application. And that picture file was the resolution of 1536 by 800. So that's maybe a little bit more likely since that file is already in the beta that, that the next uh, version of the iPad 2 screen will probably be that resolution since the Retina display kind of or the 2048 by 1536 will probably cost Apple a little bit more money right now than they probably want to spend on production of the iPad 2. And also it's for more about the hardware it's uh, very rumored that the app the iPad 2 is going to have a dual core processor inside of that bad boy which will really beast up the processing help for faster better looking games and just overall performance of the OS itself and I think that is very very much true now there have been some leaked cases uh, from manufacturers showing the iPad uh, potentially having an SD card slot and also having a bigger uh, speaker a, a speaker which will be very much welcome on the iPad 2 that actually extends a little bit to the back of the iPad provide a richer sound and also a possible mini display port up, up at the top and also a front and rear camera uh, now speaking of the cameras in the software for the iOS 4.3 beta that went out there was uh, people found out that there actually were the icons and everything for FaceTime photo booth and a camera application in the 4.3 software uh, for the iPad and I actually had a little picture of those icons as well um, so FaceTime looks like it'd be coming so definitely ensuring of a front facing camera rear facing camera still kind of eh, you know I don't see a lot of use for that on the tablet but I think Apple should put it on there just case just cuz and also the photo booth application is going to be bringing some cool effects that you find in photo booth a, a lot of cool effects you can be adding to your pictures I don't know why they just didn't combine that in the camera app itself but they got the separate photo booth application supposedly coming and also some multi-touch gestures maybe coming to the iPad as well and also the iPhone too that's been found in this beta so you can uh, uh, with four fingers or five fingers I'm looking at my fingers like I don't know how many I got but four fingers or five fingers I'm um, swipe through uh, applications that are running through the background or bring up the multitasking bar at the bottom there or close an application by pinching in and all that stuff looks pretty cool but Apple did say that uh, that is not going to be coming in the next 4.3 update so uh, we kind of so that I mean we, again we don't know exactly when the iPad 2 is going to be coming so that may not the iPad 2 may not be coming for another couple of months so they may just be saying that now trying not to get their hopes up but once the iPad officially launches it may have that software in there and also there've been some uh, little hints at a new thing called Find My Friends and also photo streams that are going to be coming possibly to mobile me customers out there and find my friends is just be able to find your friends that you your closest friend or whatever um, using the GPS in their phones or anything in, in the iPad may be able to triangulate, triangulate their position and they may have the cool things to be able to meet up at a restaurant show you what you're doing and all that stuff with find my friends and also photo streams is supposedly going to be able to allow you to uh, your camera automatically all the pictures you take of your camera the last 30 days will be backed up on the mobile me servers and uh, you can have any of your friends you can and allow them to be able to see those pictures at any time. Now I don't know how good that is because uh, that you can put you in some compromised positions there. But that's supposedly uh, supposedly going to be coming as well. So anyway, uh, that's a real quick recap of some of the latest rumors. I think a lot of those are going to be coming to the iPad 2. Stay tuned for more for news and uh, especially when the iPad 2 launches, I'll have more details about that. And thanks for watching the video, guys. And I will catch you later. Peace. And also leave all your comments about what you may think would be in the next iPad 2 down below. All right, peace out for real this time.